Hey yo, what's going on? What's going on? What is going on? Hey, it's your boy Nori, and today we have a different video for you all. Today, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be reviewing a Kemi Moto motorcycle cup holder. So stay tuned. Hey, welcome back to the Gliding on Tools YouTube channel. I'm your host, Nori. Hey, thank you for uh, coming along on this video. Like I said, well, today what I have is a Kemimoto motorcycle cup holder. I'm going to look at it, review it for you all, and just give you my honest feedback on it. So, without further ado, here we go. I already opened the box. I'm not going to spend some time. I'm not going to do an unboxing. So, what I have here, all right, is the Kemimoto cup holder. It's made from synthetic leather. Can you all see that? And then the actual top portion, the rim is aluminum, has your ball joint uh, receiver right, right in here. All right, so it's got a chrome finish, of course. It has rivets that go around, if you can all see that right there on three different points that attaches to the rim, all right, to the aluminum piece. Not too bad in itself. On the inside here, on the top, you can see it has these little rubber finger joints here on each of those attachments. And that's basically there to kind of hold your, uh, your cup steady, okay? On the inside and bottom, dead center, you'll see a hole. All right, and that hole right there is basically made to drain out fluids that you might have leaked in there, condensation, rain water, whatever have you. Now this uh, material here is kind of, like I said, a synthetic leather, made pretty well, I would say. I haven't tested it, so we, 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 we will find out. All right, but I'm pulling on it just to make sure that these, uh, rivets there that's attaching to the uh, aluminum kind of is going to, you know, test it out very well. All right. So if you can all see that, it's a pretty big cup holder. I'm going I'm, I'm to test some different size cups in here and see what all fits in there. All right. Moving along here. Now this one is for your handlebars. All right. It, it does come with the handlebar clamp, if you all can see that. And the ball is a rubber ball. All right. And it also comes with a couple different rubber pieces. All right. These rubber inserts, if you all can see. All right. Well, these rubber inserts are for, I would say it's for two, two reasons. Okay. Uh, one is for different size handlebars. All right. So this cup holder and the clamp can accommodate a one inch handlebar a one and one eighth of an inch and a one and a quarter inch handlebar all right so you got two different size inserts one is for the one inch the the other one is for the one and one eighth of an inch and then for an inch and a quarter handlebar no rubber inserts all right and these rubber inserts also protect the handlebars as well all right so without with that being said what i'm going to do is we're going to move over to the bike and then we're gonna install it and I'm gonna test out different cup, different size cups. All right, now we are gonna get started installing a motorcycle cup holder with the clamp to the bar. I got the most room on the left side of my bar, so that's where I'm gonna go ahead and put the clamp. I do not need any of the inserts because my bars are one and a quarter inch thick, so they should just fit nice and snug, all right? Kind of, kind of position it where you want it and then get the screw hand started. All right, and once you get it hand started with the provided Allen wrench, you go ahead and kind of position where you want that cup holder for starters, and then just tighten it down. Now, let's attach 
the cup holder to the actual clamp. Now you're going to have to loosen the receiver here. Kind of get it up and over. Let me loosen it some more. So that way you can put it around the ball. Now that you have it around the bar and around the ball, go ahead and retighten. All right, now that we have we have our cup holder installed the way we want it, now let's test some different size bottles or cups. All right, your standard little water bottle, of course it fits right in there. And of course you see I have the water bottle full, not going anywhere. Slamming it down so the adjustment's pretty pretty good on the bar. Fits right in there. Like I said, the rubber uh, finger holds them in the middle, all right? Now this one's a little bit small, so she might shake around a little bit on you. Get a little coffee mug, all right? That's thicker than a water bottle. Fits right in there, no issues. All right, all the way down. Pull it up, get yourself a drink. All right, if you're a monster drinker, your monster cup, or can I should say, right in. All right. And it still ain't moving. All right. Let's see here. I got another little uh, kind of Yeti cup. All right. Right in there. This one's not full. I didn't fill this one up with anything. But as you can see, fits right in there. The rubber fingers keeps it in the middle and makes it a little, little hard to kind of pull out. Not really hard, but just good enough to where it ain't going to go flying down the highway. Now for my biggest one, all right, my trusted biggest, this will defend Yeti. All right, as you can see, it has a skinnier bottom and then it, it, it gets uh, fatter on top. And that fits in there all the way to where it gets fat. All right, and it's nice and snug. All right, will that present a problem down the highway? We're gonna test it out. We're gonna test it out while it's full. All right. So now that we installed it, different cup sizes, I'm gonna take it to the road and test it out. Alrighty, alrighty. I've been testing out this uh, Kemimoto cup holder, alright, for your handlebars. And uh, I've been testing out for the last couple of days. I've used uh, the different cup sizes in it. Hasn't presented a problem yet. I got my big fat Yeti in there right now full of water. And uh, it's, doing, it's doing fairly well. It's been roughly like four days since I shot the beginning of this footage and this video. And she's doing fairly well. Not too bad. I don't have uh, not one single complaint so far with it. And usually, uh, to be honest, cup holders disappoint me every now and then. Uh, so this one hasn't disappointed me yet. I'm really, uh, really kind of satisfied with this. A uh, cup holder here from Kemimoto. So, uh, I'm not going to keep you all too long. So, if you're interested in a, uh, in a cup holder or whatnot, uh, I'm going to post the link for this one down in my descriptions below. So, that way you all can uh, go ahead and uh, visit that link and uh, purchase a uh, cup holder if you, if you want a cup holder if you don't have one already. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to leave you all now. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my ride, and I hope you all enjoy your ride.